Hey guys, good Thursday morning. Honestly, I feel really bad this morning. But I wanted to come out to the building. <clears throat> There's the pond, not running. Let's come out to the building and get an idea of what we're going to do this weekend. Because it is already Thursday. <coughs> I want to try to do as many pieces as we can, so we're probably going to do more simple pieces. Like, I really want to get the stools done. There's four of those. There's at like a coffee, not a coffee table, but kind of like an end table. That will be easy. Um, <clears throat> honestly. The clock would be probably pretty easy, too, because we don't have to, well, we could tape this off, but it's easy to clean the paint off with a, a razor blade. That would probably be a cool <coughs> thing, and I'm, I want him to take this out, and I want him to take all the guts out, so this is just a shelf area, and it'll just be, I want him to put a shelf in here, and it's just going to be for knickknacks. It won't be a functional clock. <clears throat> There's this old piece that looks terrible. The rocker. This kind of a magazine rack table. I just want to take, like, this little shelf table. I want to take all these pieces that would be just a simple spray where we don't have to, like, <clears throat> do too much to them. And just knock them out. Get them done. Something like this. That's going to be a bunch of work. We've got a bunch of chairs too. We've got four um, of these chairs. And then we have four other chairs in the vintage stuff and things trailer. <clears throat> that cedar chest wouldn't be too bad. Just have to take off the hardware. And then I have these black pieces of uh, stuff that I had at the shop. They're just little knick-knack shelves. And those would be easy to paint. So, I just wanted to come out here and refresh my mind what was out here. So, um, so happy I got it cleaned up out here. Boy, my husband... Ooh, he just shoves stuff in here. And look how overgrown it is outside. You can't even see the lake. It's crazy town. All right, I'm going to go in and lay down. I'll talk to you guys later. I did what I said. It came in to lay down. <coughs> and look who came with me. <laughs> and I'm very pleased that you invited me to be with you today, and I prepared a few words for this important occasion. Crash. Saturday morning, and I'm still sick. <coughs> I went to the doctor again. So I went to the doctor Sunday, and I went to the doctor on Friday. He rechecked everything. He says, it's definitely viral. I can't give you any antibiotics that will do anything for viral. <clears throat> he says, take Mucinex, do a nasal rinse, lay down. It could last three weeks. I'm like, no. I can't be this sick for three weeks. I feel like I got much sicker than honey. But I guess it affects everybody differently. <clears throat> I, I asked, I'm on the ASC supplies design team. I texted her and I told her I was really sick. 
and I just wasn't feeling crafty. Sometimes when I have to craft with something specific, I, I can't because I wasn't feeling crafty. I couldn't make myself work with that stuff. And I don't mean to sound like it was bad stuff. It's not bad at all. But I somehow felt like I needed to work with ocean stuff. So, I got the month off from ASC Supplies and I got out some ocean stuff. I don't know if you remember this paper collection from, oh gosh, was it three or four years ago? Um, Heartfelt Creations. So, <coughs> yesterday afternoon, I cut up all these pieces. And this morning, I started embellishing them with bling. So that's what I've been doing. I wish I could lay back down. But every time I lay down, I start coughing. So I slept in the chair last night. The big overstuffed chair in the living room. And I have to tell you, Rizzo jumped right up and curled up with me. But she, but she wanted to be with me too, and she wouldn't fit. So she put her front end of the body, of her body, in the chair, the ottoman. And her legs were standing up, and she laid there about 20 minutes. Poor baby. And then when she got down, she walked around and she came back. But she was very concerned about me. And it was really sweet. Because she's not typically a sweet kind of dog. But she definitely was. So as far as my voice goes, the doctor said the reason why I'm losing my voice is because all the coffee is damaging my, <clears throat> my vocal cords and that's why that's happening today is Saturday which means it's my last work day of the week and I have two days I can just like be home and rest yesterday I had to go get some more mucinex which I hate but I picked up the things at the grocery store we needed since I had to go there And so for two days, I'm just going to stay home and rest as much as I can. Um, I really wanted to do vintage stuff and things tomorrow on Sunday. And I might go out and direct Honey on what to do. But I need to rest. Because I can't be this sick for three weeks. I need to go to Texas and help my cousin with the booth space and I have to get well before I can even book a flight because I certainly don't want to go um, like this to visit my mom. Um, although the doctor did say I'm not contagious, I still just wouldn't want to be around her like this. So, oh my gosh, we're almost at six minutes. I shouldn't be talking this much. I just wanted to give you guys like a hey weetsy update and I'll see you later. Bye. It's Sunday. I'm smiling because <clears throat> last night I decided to take Theraflu. No mucinex. Theraflu. And I slept all night long. I fell asleep watching Love Actually. It was great. And then I got up for about 
<clears throat> three hours. I watched some, um, what is that show called with Joanna and Chip Gaines? I watched that for a couple hours. Worked a little bit on cards. <clears throat> to sleep and got up. I've been up, I don't know, four hours and I'm feeling better. I don't feel good by any stretch of the imagination. The throat hurts the worst, but I feel better. And I've had my loyal companion right here. He that one. She's been like a mommy to me, with me everywhere I go. Rizzo <laughs> just curls up with me. <clears throat> but Shiva, I don't know. She's been really sweet. Watch, watch. <laughs> Can we do it again? Okay, we'll do it again. Okay, enough of that. <clears throat> Been loading up on Gatorade. I'm fixing to go take a shower. Take another dose of Theraflu. Watch Fear the Walking Dead. I've just been, you know, I mean, <clears throat> I got a, this a shaker card, two shaker card toppers. Actually, this one. Ooh, this one's blingy. And I have uh, not this one. So, oh, and I have this, but it's not really finished yet. These aren't either, but this is what I've been doing today. And I think I might have said, <clears throat> I've been feeling kind of like creating stuff for ocean and sea themed. And so that's what I'm doing. I have to, sometimes when I get in this mode, I just have to do what, what I feel like doing. That's what I feel like doing. But anyway, definitely, definitely better. So, I just thought I'd let you know, because a lot of you expressed um, <clears throat> good thoughts and prayers, and I appreciate them. i going to have some more Gatorade. difficult for me is that finding these great things on Facebook Marketplace and I want to go get them but I can't but we're going to play in the laundry room in a little while he said he would hang up all my stuff and um, so I'll probably do a video for the other channel for that I just heard something that made a whole lot of sense what? are we videoing? yes so I'm watching the NFL Network <clears throat> and you know what my battles have been, um, as far as work is concerned. And Daryl Dawkins, one of the Hall of Fame running backs, said, it doesn't matter what you did to get there. What are you going to do when you achieve that? And? That's what I said. But I thought it was pretty profound. Yeah. Like but it depends if you get where you're going and you're happy or you get where you're going and you're unhappy. But to get where I was going, I was unhappy too. Yeah. So I need to create my own happiness from what I've already achieved. Ooh, there you go. Yeah. Me and Shiva are going to get under clean bedlands. And we're going to achieve happiness watching Fear the Walking Dead. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. All right. And on that, we bid you adieu. Bye, guys. <laughs>